Okay pizza fans, I'm going to show you how to make the easiest homemade pizza. If I can make it, then you can make it. Let me know in the comments below if you give this a go and how it turns out for you. I've got 8 ingredients for my favourite pizza. All of this cost me just over $26 and can easily make 4 pizzas, with some ingredients left over for the next time. First up, you need a good tomato base. A plain tomato paste will do just fine, but I use this pizza sauce which has garlic and herbs to add some flavour. Next, you need some good cheese. You can use just mozzarella cheese, but I got this packet which is a mix of mozzarella, cheddar and parmesan cheese. The rest of the toppings is entirely up to your own tastes, but I use a green capsicum to add some colour, some cocktail onions to add some tangy flavour, and I love pineapple on my pizza. Okay, I'm waiting for all the comments for all the pineapple on pizza haters. Bring it on. I also use this spicy Hungarian salami. You can use any sort of meat products like pepperoni, sliced ham, roast chicken, or if you really want to impress your vegetarian girlfriend, then leave off the meat. Finally, I use this pizza topper, which is a mix of herbs, with marjoram, basil, oregano, parsley and thyme. What time? Pizza time! Now, rather than making my own pizza dough, or using those terrible store-bought pizza bases, I use this Lebanese bread, which makes the pizza thin and crispy. Next, it's time to prepare all the toppings ready to load up onto the pizza. For the green capsicum, chop off the ends, then cut into thin slices, then chop up again into bits about one inch long. For the cocktail onions, just dice these up into small little pieces to sprinkle all over the pizza. Then for the pineapple slices, chop these up into smaller pieces. The easiest part is taking the salami out of the packet. Now slice these up into any size you like. Now all the ingredients are ready and the fun begins to load up the pizza. Now you just need a thin layer of the tomato pizza sauce. Just make sure you spread it right out to the edges to stop them from burning. Then load up all the toppings, spacing them apart so they are not on top of each other. You only need a light covering of the cheese as this will melt and cover the pizza. Then a final tap of the pizza topping and it's ready to go. I only made three pizzas for this run. I probably could have spaced out the ingredients to make four. Now you can cook these in a normal oven at 180 degrees celsius for about 10 minutes. But I've got this cool pizza maker which cooks these up in 7 minutes. So there you go, the easiest homemade pizza. Let me know if you try this at home in the comments below. Also, let me know if you like this video, and if enough people like it, I'll bring you more easy cooking videos real soon. Happy eating, everyone.